told you about the closing of the Baker Ripley Dementia Day Center. It's one of only two centers that are dedicated to adult daycare for dementia patients. And now, 24 hours after that announcement, elected officials are weighing in on that closing. Our Sion Rhodes is live tonight at the center there in southwest Houston with a look at the impact of this. Sion? Elected officials and families are mobilizing, hoping that something can be done to try to save the center. Some of the things they're looking at right now is maybe a donation from the private sector or a partnership, anything that could change the status quo. To see her blossom, uh, and you know, I say, did you dance today? Yeah. I say, how was your day? And she said, it was great. And I said, the people are nice. She said, yeah, they're very nice. Jim Murtha's partner of 21 years, Kay, had only been attending the Baker Ripley Dementia Day Center for a few weeks when he learned it was being shut down. I was shocked. The facility, one of only two in the Houston area that gives caregivers like Jim a break during the day and the only one that accepts patients with moderate to late stage dementia. But if you want to live at home as long as possible, there's nothing else. He wrote a letter to Baker Ripley leadership imploring them to have a change of heart. The day center's closure would be a huge blow, not only to our well-being, but the health of the Houston community at large. In response, the nonprofit wrote Jim saying, quote, the decision to close the center is the result of a comprehensive and rigorous two-year strategic and financial assessment. Jim and families like his hoping something can be done to save the center. I think we need to get the word out. So many people have already been touched by dementia, and it's just a matter of time before everybody is. You can hear and see and feel the pain that these families are experiencing as they tr struggle to figure out what to do. Today, we heard from Houston City Councilwoman Abby Kamen, who represents the district where this center is located. She said, quote, I was saddened to learn of the planned closing of Baker Ripley's Dementia Day Center and am extremely concerned about where this will leave the residents they serve. My office has reached out to Baker Ripley and is meeting with them about how we can help, end quote. This is, of course, a still developing story. We will continue to keep you updated. Live in Southwest Houston, Sion Rhodes, KPRC. Two news.